Recently, with the maiden flight of China's new generation of warplanes, Evryon's attention has been focused on the innovative work of Chengjia and Xinfei. However, in fact, a more mysterious large strategic UAV has also quietly appeared, which is our protagonist today, Divine Eagle, large unmanned early warning aircraft. This all-black, C-5 drone has a rare dual fuselage design, and its appearance has undoubtedly attracted widespread attention and discussion. Some people say, who would have thought that a door frame could fly into the sky? Of course, this is just a playful expression of the unique shape of the Divine Eagle. In fact, it was crafted by Avex Xinyang Institute to meet the challenge of enemy stealth fighters. A full decade has passed since it was first discovered, and the choice of the end of 2024 is not only a milestone, but also marks a major breakthrough in its development. Conventional AWACS are constrained by the physiological limits of pilots and the limitations of airframe design, usually not exceeding an active altitude of 12,000 meters and with a limited detection range of only about 400 kilometers, not to mention staying aloft for long periods of time, usually needing to return to base within 10 hours. With the widespread use of modern stealth fighters, and advanced air-to-air -air missiles. The survivability of traditional AWACS on the battlefield is encountering unprecedented challenges, so can the introduction of large unmanned aircraft such as the Divine Eagle be a game chainer? Obviously, large unmanned early warning aircraft in a number of aspects show obvious advantages. First of all, because there is no need to consider the safety of personnel, its development and design is more free, and it can be directly used as a platform carrier for sensors. Second, Compared with manned aircraft, the development and maintenance costs are relatively inexpensive, enabling it to take on more tasks in complex battlefield environments. More importantly, the endurance of the Divine Eagle is amazing, able to fly for dozens of hours, and the large radius of the combat coverage makes it almost all-weather duty. Interestingly, despite its huge size, the Divine Eagle is equipped with only one engine. So what kind of engine? can meet the requirements of the Divine Eagle for thrust and fuel consumption. For this problem, not long ago, the 15th Zhuhai Air Show on the exposure of the nine days of the U of E may be able to give the answer, from the publicity video, can be found. Nine days of the engine used by the Turbofan 9 is a version of the no expansion of the FWS-9YZ, Turbofan 9, after all, engaged in nearly 30 years. Eight also more thorough on the basis of which the development of a no-expansion version of the problem is not too big. Will the FWS-9YZ be used for the Shin Eagle, which is also a super-large drone? FWS-9YZ thrust of 5.6 tons. Given the turbofan 9's very low fuel consumption, only 0.684 kg kg force hour, although the FWS-9YZ cannot be compared to the Global Hawks, a 3007 engine, but the God of the Eagle has a large 50-meter wingspan. Taking into account the Global Hawk's range of 25,000 kilometers, the God of the Eagle's range of how to 30,000 kilometers, right? That's enough to cover half of the Pacific Ocean. In addition, its appearance is designed to be stealthy, effectively reducing radar reflections, allowing it to cruise silently in the sky. Both the U.S. and Israel have researched in this field, but so far the results have not been fruitful. While China's progress is remarkable, According to public information, the Divine Eagle, also known as the Twin-Headed Eagle, is claimed to be the world's largest high-altitude, long-endurance drone. Its wingspan is more than 50 meters, and its flight altitude can reach an amazing 25,000 meters. Not only is it an unmanned early warning aircraft, but the Eagle also has a high-altitude anti-stealth mission. Foreign media speculate that its length is between 14.4 and 18 meters, and its cruising speed can reach 0.8 Mach. Its unusual aerodynamic layout is another major feature, its flat wings, double tail and double fuselage structure provide it with excellent performance. Why is it that many international countries are attracted to the twin fuselage design, but ultimately failed to push it into the mainstream? This is because of the technical barriers in front of them, which have deterred many countries. However, China has been quietly working in this field and finally broke through the barrier and realized the successful application of double fuselage. In the structure of the double-headed eagle, a large number of radar antennas are set up in the double fuselage to realize 360-degree omnidirectional detection, and two types of radars, X-band and UF-band, are probably used for precision fire control and anti-stealth detection respectively. From some past photos and videos, we can see that the Divine Eagle Fuselage details are installed with a variety of electronic equipment and aerodynamic optimization design. These innovations have not only improved its detection capability, but also enhanced its aerodynamic efficiency. 
making it a fish out of water at high altitudes. Regarding its power system, although no detailed parameters have been released to the public, with China's recent breakthroughs in engine technology, it seems that doubts in this regard can be put aside for the time being. It is reported that although the Divine Eagle has been dormant for many years, its technical and tactical indicators have gradually become clearer, which means that it is just around the corner from mass production. Particularly noteworthy is that, in the Divine Eagle, debut again at the same time, a new generation of early warning aircraft, Air Force 3000 also came out. The synergistic effect of the two can not only significantly broaden the range of long-range early warning, but also strengthen the ability to capture stealth targets, bringing greater strategic advantages for the battlefield.